The open close principle tells us that a class must be open to be extended but close to be modified. This means that we should be able to add or modify existing behavior of a class without having to modify its source code. Let's see an example of a class that doesn't apply this principle. Here as you can see we have this process sale class and we have this pay method. And as you can see we apply this discount logic here in which depending on the value of discount type we apply a discount or not. We are not applying the open close principle because if tomorrow I want to add for example a Cyber Monday discount I will have to modify this class. One way of applying this principle is by creating an iDiscount interface and then abstracting away the logic of applying a discount behind this interface. Now in process sale we can do the following, we can inject our iDiscount and then apply it in the pay method. In this way if I want to modify the logic behind applying a discount I can do that outside of this class and therefore this class is now open to be extended but close to be modified. Follow me for more Donut content.